Hey guys, Gray here, and uh, today I'm going to show you how to build a wheat and sugarcane farm. Now what you're going to need is an area of dirt, uh, something to dig through the dirt, and two buckets of water. Now you just want to start with the wheat farm by digging around a little patch or rows and making sure that there's water on one side of each block, at least, just like so. I'm just going to do a very small version of one because it's going to be right outside my house and it's just easy access. Then you want to go through and hoe every piece of dirt you have and uh, then you just have to get started on the water. Now to do your water you basically just have to fill up the entire hole around your rows or for me the little patch that you have your weed on with water and uh, it's actually really easy to do. But when you're hoeing your dirt you want to make sure or when you're tending to the farm I guess you want to make sure that uh, none of the dirt blocks end up with grass on them because mobs will spawn in there and they will trample your crops. Now it's really important that you put water around there and if you notice one piece of dirt actually did just change for me and that was a fail. Um, your soil will not change and the wheat won't grow as fast if you don't have water around it. And the darker dirt is changed soil and it usually takes a minute but if it's not changed soil and if it's not hoed soil the wheat won't grow at all. So yeah, once you're done placing your water, you can just place seeds on each of the uh, each of the pieces of hoed soil, and you're good to go. Now, as of 1.4, spiders can't trample crops, so you don't need to put a roof or anything over this over the farm anymore. But that's all you really have to do for the wheat farm. And uh, hang on, there's one other thing you have to do. But let me just finish planting. But what you have to do is basically make a little door out of dirt I guess or you could use an actual door but I just do it like this like so and then to get in you can just destroy the top block hop in collect your wheat and then hop out all right now we're gonna head over to where we're gonna build our sugarcane farm now while I was doing the wheat farm I forgot to mention that you do have to fence the wheat farms area in now for the sugarcane farm you don't have to have fences but it is a little bit more aesthetically pleasing now for the sugarcane farm you're gonna start with the exact same area with rows or a small patch. I right now have rows and it does have to have water around it and you're going to plant sugarcane on the dirt instead of wheat. And you don't have to hoe it at all. Now you, for both farms you're gonna wanna make sure it has torches around it if you want to grow it at night. And uh, yeah, hopefully this helps you guys and that's all I have for today, but I'll be back with another tutorial soon.